Hi everyone, it's me, Benny the Digger Truck, and today we're going to read There's a Wacket in My Pocket by Dr. Seuss, and a Fendo in My Window, and a Nutcase in My Bookcase. Did you ever have the feeling there's a wacket in your basket, or a Nero in your bureau, or a Wazit in your closet? Sometimes I feel quite certain there's a jerton in the curtain. Sometimes I have the feeling there's a lock behind a clock and that zelf upon that shelf. I have talked to him myself. That's the kind of house I live in. There's a nink in the sink and a zamp in the lamp and they're rather nice I think. Some of them are very friendly, like the yacht in the pot, but that yaddle in the bottle. Some are friendly, some are not. I like the zable on the table and the gear under the chair, but that bofa on the sofa. Well, I wish he wasn't there. All those nubbards in the cupboards, they're good fun to have about. But that new thrush on my toothbrush, him I could do without. The only one I'm really scared of is that bug under the rug. And that quinny up the chimney, I don't like him, not at all. And it makes me sort of nervous when the zoll scoots down the hall. But the yeps on the steps. They're great fun to have around, and so are many, many other friends that I have found. Like the teller, and the neller, and the geller, and the deller, and the beller, and the weller, and the zeller, and the seller. And the geeling on the ceiling, and the zower in my shower. And the zillow on my pillow. I don't care if you believe it. That's the kind of house I live in, and I hope we never leave it. A fendo in my window, and a nutcase in my bookcase. The end.